Alright, looks like I am, uh, doing this again. Ha! Good for me. You know, it's gonna be great when you see episodes where I'm actually having fun, and not, like, the ulcer-inducing I'm gonna put myself through. Oh my god. Oh my god. If MJ does this better than me, I'll just end my YouTube channel. <laughs> no, not that bad. Holy crap! Thank the loving hot lord. Oh god. My my mouse went everywhere on earth and then some That's a mouth? Well, this will be my first one minute video. The saddest part of that statement is I'm only half joking. Can I just sit here and talk with you guys for like a good 10 minutes? That'll make it an episode. Oh, hey, Troy. Uh, back to Borderlands 3. I heard all the characters are playable in it. That'll make for some good team compilations. There's probably there's definitely going to be one team compilation that rules it all though. I feel like the siren would definitely be in there. Oh, is Borderlands One going to be in there too? Like Borderlands One shit? I don't know, cause I don't know any of the abilities from Borderlands One. I played two in the pre sequel. I'll find out. Maybe I'll get to see. But I'm pretty sure that Maya the Siren from Borderlands 2 will be in there. Uh, because her her team like abilities are pretty good. Like her healing abilities and shit. And with class mods, like, jeez, you can become super like healing for your team. You could shoot them, like just get in a boss room, just go to the back of the room and shoot your teammates with the most powerful sniper rifle you have. Or or a rocket launcher. Have have a rocket launcher that shoots like 17 rockets, each one healing like thousands of damage. Oh god. Alright, there could also be, I think the commando would be in there. I do, I definitely want to put in something from, I feel like Borderlands 2 has really good team compilations. For the pre-sequel, as cool as they are, I don't feel like they're good for team compilations. Although to be fair, the only one I fully went through was Claptrap, and I know he'd be pretty good for team compilations. But I feel like it wouldn't be as good as some other things you can get from, like, maybe just even the Commando. Once you get the, uh, the turret bubbles up with two turrets, you could have two safe havens for your team in a, in a, in a boss battle. And you could get two revives out of it, just like uh, with the Siren's Res ability. Does Claptrap have anything, have anything really good like that? Although, to be fair... I never fully upgraded his team play because I have no friends. So I just played alone. And when I did play with friends, I had already played the Claptrap. So I wanted to play as like Wilhelm or uh, or someone else. Actually, the aimbot girl could totally be in. What's her name? Nisha. Nisha the Lawbringer. She can be in it. Her abilities? Oh, I feel like it's really, really strong. Just pure on headshots. You'll never miss a bullet. Get the strongest gun you can. Uh, I wonder if they'll tweak their abilities. Oh, you know, balance them maybe? Or are they just gonna cut and paste them? I feel like cutting and pasting them... I feel like they should change some things up maybe. Maybe, maybe not change the final abilities. But maybe upgrade the sucky abilities, because I feel like at the moment there are just like certain sets, depending on which, if you're going for like, say you're going Maya, I feel like you'll go like down Destruction. If you're playing alone, I feel like if you're playing Maya, you're going to go down the Destruction team, you're going to go down the Destruction, which is pure fire, ice, lava, anything you can think of, all, all elements, murdering someone. Oh, I'm going to play this game while I talk about this now. I think I'm prepared. Okay, so I think that could totally be cool, but, like, if there are just some, like, pretty much every time you're going to play it, you're going to pick, like, the same abilities, because there is just 
like other abil the other abilities aren't good and like you need to pick i think it's like you need 26 points 26 points of full skill tree so 25 you need five skills and there are like five oh that was nice there are like five skills that like rule them all honestly there really are and like in that skill tree like i, I just don't think anything can beat them it's like the reaper skill i feel like you'll pick the reaper skill every time and there might be like some people who have slight deviations but like when you do the math some skills are just better like there's the flicker skill which is like pretty good if you're going all fire but fire itself is just weak because robots uh but like even the, like the the percentage you can like i'm pretty sure it's up to like 20 something 30 something percent but that's a percent of a percent that's not added on so if you have a let's let's make it nice let's give you like a sniper rifle if you have a 50 percent chance to ignite something that, that doesn't become 80 that becomes 30 percent of 50. Right, so it's a percent on a percent. Now I'm teaching you fucking math. This is going to be really boring. I'm just in a lot of pain and wanted to talk about shit I liked. I am sorry. And if it happens again, I'm sorry to tell you, but please keep watching my video and go through the pain for me. Thank you. Very appreciated. Troy, Troy likes you too. Mm -hmm. Why didn't your... F Back to Borderlands it is. All right, so yeah, the flicker skill. So like, let's give it the best case scenario. Say it's 30, 50. What is 30%? So like, make it about one third. We're gonna, we're gonna give it all the best numbers. Oh God, what have I done to myself? Troy, are you okay, buddy? Oh, Troy's fine. Okay, so let's make it 33%, which is one third. Divide 50 by three, and that 50% that only becomes Ooh, good for me. That 50% only becomes, uh, what is it? What's one third of 50? Uh, one, six, it becomes like 66. So it's not that much. And that's best case scenario. Other weapons usually have a lot smaller ones, like 20 to 30. Like assault rifles and submachine guns. I don't know what pistols are. I'm pretty sure pistols like lie along that range too. But still, like, if you have 30, that only goes up to 40. And anything less than that, you get, like, super low. That's five points. You could put that into something else and get, like, much better um, value out of, like, those five points. Honestly. Like, it's kind of sad. My friend would play that game, and we would look at his skill trees and just be like, what the fuck were you thinking? Do you want to die, you noob? You nub? I don't even know. I really like the siren. I gotta play that game again. I gotta make a solo run. But the thing is, I hate playing solo because, like, my end goal is I want to beat like the biggest bosses in the game. J Jesus Christ, Troy! Right? I want to beat like the biggest bosses in that game. But like solo, that is just so fucking difficult. Unless I like get to ultimate vault hunter mode, upgrade everything to the max, get. But then I would have to farm everything. I think I would just rather. But then I feel like if you're strong enough to kill them. I feel like it almost takes away the challenge of killing them. Like, I feel like killing them with a team with mediocre equipment is more fun than killing them alone. It's probably not as honorable. Like, the honor and, like, glory you get from killing them alone. I Don't get me wrong. Like, you're pretty... You're, you're god tier if you can kill, like, the ultimate vault bosses alone. And I'm not talking about the story mode bosses. I'm talking about, like, Hyperius the Invincible and shit. If you can kill those guys alone, like, I, I fucks with you. You are an amazing human being. I wish to follow in your footsteps, Dad. <laughs> Go! No, my head hit the lamp. Good for me. Yeah, but, like, I've killed... I killed one. Oh, Pyro Pete. Uh, luckily for me... You see, this is what I'm talking about, because I had... The thing is, I didn't, I didn't have that good of weapons. I had a decent couple legendaries. Maybe not the best legendaries. Uh, but it was the end of True Vault Hunter mode, I was at level 50, I had a gun, no, it was a psycho, that's who I was. I didn't ask you, Bennett! What the fuck, that doesn't even make sense. I'm gonna go back to fucking... I'm gonna go back to fucking Borderlands with this shit. Oh, the pain is just so, so great here. 
All right, let me try not to die. This will be very nice for me. Very nice. All right, and there is an intruder in my room. Uh, come on, Troy, I believe in you. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Troy, I love you. Oh, my God, you're playing this game? You wait. Oh, caught myself. No, Jesus Christ, Troy. Troy. Frederick, oh, that's how you, what the, how do you pronounce that? I'm going to go back to speaking about Borderlands because that's when I'm the least clinically depressed. <laughs> Don't laugh. That's not funny. Why'd you get this game? Oh, I was going to make MJ play it. And then as I've played it, I've realized that I'm going to put my brother through this. I'm an awful human being. Y you are. Do you want to go? Leave. I saw. Y you've, lost, you've lost your right to be in this room as I record this game. I saw Markiplier play this. Oh my god. You, you, you don't, no, you don't just get to call me a bad person and then watch the rest of this video. Watch it on fucking YouTube. Get out of my room. <laughs> nope. He's gonna stay here. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stand still. You can't even look at Troy in pain. I'm gonna go back to talking about Borderlands. Actually, I'm at the Tunnel of Death for like the fourth time. Tunnel of Death? Oh, yeah, that's, I, I don't know. Maybe it's like the Succubus Tunnel, because like... This tunnel's a demon, and it has, like, a vagina in the back of it. Look at that hole in the wall. It's, I'm glad I have someone that reacts to this now. It's really weird just saying that to myself. I said it the first time I saw it. At least now someone was laughing to it. <laughs> I feel a little sick. Troy, why are you dropping? You should have... Mu you have muscles like a god. Look at these muscles. How are you letting your... What? Is this man sunburned? I'm sorry. I'll get you in the shade. You look severely sunburned. Are you okay? Is this guy, like, stuck in a pot? I don't know this whole story. Uh, there isn't a story. And I'm pretty sure when asked, Bennett Foddy said so he wouldn't break his legs when he fell. That's why he's in that pot. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Okay. So, guess how high I was earlier. How high? You know where the stairs are? Yes. There. I was at the stairs in the air. I made it past the tower. And I fell... Did you made it past the windmill? The windmill? I don't know that much about this game, bro. I have no idea what the windmill is. It's literally a windmill. <laughs> I just knew this was a rage game. And I knew Bennett Foddy was the guy who created Co-op. So I was like, excellent. Let me make MJ play it. Oh I also know there's a reward at the end that you're not supposed to show on the internet. And I want to I wanna reach it. Oh yeah, but if you're in the room, I'm going to force you to leave. Because you cannot look at the reward unless you've done this yourself, brother. Jesus Christ, Troy! By the way, his name is Troy. You named him that, or is that his actual name? I, I, I wish I wish that was his actual name. I don't know why, but I, I got I got Matt. Maybe his name is Troy, and I like forgot that somewhere. Jesus Christ, Troy! And uh, <laughs> get out! Get out! Nope. Now you're leaving. Nope. Get out! You're laughing at my pain. Get out! Get out. No, the way you look nope, in the I'm getting up. Get out. Get up. Get out. Get up. Get out. I'm trying to get over it. Get out. Get out. Oh, get the fall out of here. Stop bouncing that shit in my face. Get the fuck out. <laughs> oh my god. I'm going back to talk about Borderlands. Once he leaves. Leave. <laughs> oh. I'm, I'm cutting the episode here. Nah. I'm, right, no. Leaving, leaving. Nah. Fuck. No. Don't torture them. No, Andy, this is like 13 minutes of my pure pain. It's no joke, no, I'm just kidding. Get out of here. Leave. This episode's over. See you all in the next episode as I have another ulcer. <laughs> Watch me fail at getting over this house. Oh my god, did I call it or what? Huzzah. See you all in the next episode. I'm in a lot of pain. <laughs> You're always here with me now. Hi right, guys, how's it going? Mark Get out! The first time I watched Mark play this game, he flipped his chair.